Hey, this is Caleb I, and thanks for joining us here on Millennial Z for our 101 Beginner's Guide to Sea of Thieves. Our 101 videos are meant to be short and to the point, so not to waste your time giving you the information that you're looking for. For that reason, there's going to be a lot missing, so like and subscribe for more specific topic videos. Of course, the best place to start is at the beginning, which in this case, you'll find yourself in a tavern on one of the pirate outposts in Sea of Thieves. Before you leave, you'll want to grab any and all resources from the barrels inside and outside around the tavern. Your ship will be docked at one of the jetties on the beach. You'll want to load it up with the resources you gathered and then make a few more trips for more resources. It's important to load up with as much as you can as few things are frustrating as winning a battle at sea only to sink because you didn't have enough wood to repair your ship. For this video, we're focusing on the sloop as the other larger ships are more advanced and are best for use with a few friends. On the sloop, your munitions barrels are on the deck. There are starting supplies in both barrels and only munitions like cannonballs and firebombs can be stored in them. Below deck, you have a wood barrel that again can only store wood and you also have two barrels for food. Also below deck are the customization chests that allow you to change your cosmetics, a stove for cooking food, and a water barrel for putting out fires. Once you're happy with the amount of supplies you've gathered, grab some quests from one of the guilds and head back to your ship. But don't raise anchor just yet. You will need to propose a quest and have all crew members vote on it to get started. Then, locate your destination on the ship's map table and note the direction you're going to be sailing in. Lastly, put out all the lanterns except the two below deck. Lanterns make you a beacon for other players and you certainly don't want to give them an itch. With treasure on the brain and a bearing to head in, you can raise anchor, drop sails, and grab the helm to steer in the direction needed. Sailing isn't overly complicated, but there are a few things you need to know. First, your speed is dictated by both the amount of sail that you have lowered and the angle of your sail in relation to the wind direction. When trying to maneuver around an island to find a good place to park, it's easier if you're moving a little slower. Also good to know is that the sloop is overall the slowest ship, but if another larger ship is pursuing you, you can head into the wind because the sloop is the fastest ship when sailing against the wind. The last thing we'll cover in this beginner's guide is how not to sink. Your ship will take on water either because of holes in the hull or rain during a storm. This water can be bailed out by use of a bucket, and I recommend standing on the stairs and chucking the water out the window as this seems to be the fastest way to bail on a sloop. If you have holes, you will need to patch them with wood to keep the water from spilling in. All this can be really hectic during a fight, but don't sweat it. Practice makes perfect. Alright, thanks for checking us out. If the video was helpful, give it a like and a share, and subscribe for more content.